So in this video, I will be talking about the paternity leave in Norway. Hi, my name is Andreas and I want to talk about paternity leave today. When the mother gives birth to your child, you have the right to have two weeks absence of work. And if uh, that is paid, it all comes down to collective agreement. In Norway, we have right to have paternity leave 49 weeks with 100% of her salary or 59 weeks with 80% of her salary. But that's not entirely true. It's either 100% up to, it's 100% up to, no, 6G. 6G is the basic amount in the national insurance. But as with all benefits tend to change every four years with in line with the parliamentary election. Personally, I think this period should be less for us men because the child have more use of her mother in the first year of living. So that's my opinion. But since we have we have uh, me and my wife have chosen that she have had uh, some unpaid leave from work so that she could stay home more with Selma and uh, yes it's nice so now she is sleeping out on the terrace and we are here in making content for YouTube so but I think it's a really 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 good idea to have paternity leave both for children or no both for mothers of course but also for the men so I think all men should take out paternity leave when they have the opportunity. I think uh, both it serves the children and the dads well. And this is all covered in the Working Environment Act in Norway. And what it is in your country, I don't know. Please let me know in the comment below. And please give me a like. And also hit that subscribe button if you want to see more good content about Norwegian welfare agreement.